Hi guys. So guys, today I want to share an easy, easy pot roast recipe with you guys. I made it the other night and it was delicious. And it's super easy, y'all. So the first thing you're going to need, of course, is a roast. Mine's is about 2 pounds, maybe a little bit more. About 2.25 pounds, I think it was. But you're going to need that. And because this is a barbecue roast, you want to kind of make a barbecue seasoning for this or if you have like a barbecue and all-in-one barbecue seasoning just use that that's even easier but um, I kind of created a little rub mine's I used some Lari seasoned salt I used a little bit of lemon pepper I used some smoked paprika the smoked paprika is going to give it that nice smoky barbecue flavor I'm also going to use a little bit of garlic salt, some black pepper, I'm going to add just a little bit of chili powder, some onion powder, garlic powder, salt, and I'm going to add just a little bit of brown sugar. Anytime I make my barbecue seasoning or barbecue rubs. I love adding just a touch of brown sugar for sweetness. So um, now we're just going to go ahead and rub our roast down. And then we're going to go ahead and flip it over and we're going to repeat all the same seasonings. And then we're going to rub it in. So here I have my cast iron skillet. It's nice and hot. You want it to be smoking a little bit because you want it really nice and hot because you want to get a nice sear char on this roast. So I'm going to go ahead and add in a little bit of canola oil or veggie oil. And then I'm going to add my roast in. We want to sear our roast on both sides to lock in that juice and all that flavor. Now, like I said, this is a barbecue pot roast. So you're going to need a bottle of barbecue sauce. Um, I'm going to use Sweet Baby Ray's, but just use your favorite. Now you want to add a little bit of sauce to the bottom of your roaster, whatever you're roasting your um, pot roast in. And then you're going to go ahead and add your roast, and then you're going to add the rest of the barbecue sauce on top. Now if you want, you can add in some sliced onions, some sliced bell pepper, garlic. You can add whatever you want, but I just kept it pretty easy, you guys. So now we're just going to add the lid on there and we're going to pop this in the oven at 325 and we're going to let it slowly cook for two to two and a half hours until it's fall apart, tender, juicy, y'all. Like I said, it's super easy and it's so, so good. Yum.